Welcome back to TV Land's Top 10 Look at TV's All-Time Best Holiday Moments. If you're just tuning in, here's a quick recap of the countdown so far. The Andy Griffith Show, Sanford and Son, Cheers, Bing Crosby and David Bowie, and All in the Family. At number five is Andy Williams, who didn't set out to be thought of as Mr. Christmas. But starting in the early 60s, he had a weekly variety show, and he had to work through the holidays. But then Andy had a brainstorm. Instead of being isolated from his family at Christmas, why not feature them on his show? And that way, they could all be together. That simple idea turned out to be Christmas magic. And for 20 straight years on television, Andy and his family showed us why Christmas is indeed the most wonderful time of the year. Nobody ever looked better in a sweater than Andy Williams. It's a little hard to remember today how much Andy Williams meant to the women of America. He was vaguely sexy, but kind of manly, but shamelessly romantic. The content of those shows, uh, the musicality of those shows, and, and the way they were shot um, you know, were just top form. And now, here is the star of our show, Andy Williams. Christmas is a time for sharing a joy, and sharing the music, the Christmas music. The shows are always beautifully done. The music is beautiful. The scenery is great. People, I think, want to celebrate Christmas. Want to see a, a great Christmas show. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Holiday specials, when I see them on television today, I always say the same thing. Why don't they make them like they used to? Why don't they make them like the old Andy Williams show? It was a, a, a more innocent time. You knew nobody was going to get their bodice ripped off or say any four-letter words. I like that view of things, even if it's pretend, because you, I think you need a fantasy that is pleasant. Me, oh my, it's a holiday. Me, oh my, everybody's gay. You can have as much talent as you want, but it'll never see the light of day unless you have a break. Andy gave us that national television exposure that uh, introduced us to America. Andy Williams were the Osmonds, you know, corny, yes, but damn it, it was good. They were the nicest people and um, just all American, and uh, I'm just a sucker for that. I would watch that anytime. The Osmond family um, were pretty much a byproduct in the sense of Andy Williams. They were so cute, so wonderful, I thought. You know, it's not a big deal for me to put them on the show. They'll do a song, and that'll be it. The next day, the phones were ringing, and the letters that came in were terrific. And wanted to see more of the Osmond brothers. And so I asked them to come back the next year, and they said, yes, sir. It was a running joke on The Andy Williams Show, what Andy was going to make us do the following week. I'll never forget the feeling that I got when he said, okay, guys, you're going to ice skate. Never ice skated before in my life. It's the most wonderful time. At the very end, when I slid through their legs, I went, it's over. <laughs> Those were the great days, you know, the, in my opinion, uh, of television, when it was very, you, you felt with them. You just weren't entertained by them, but you, you were taken into their home, or and, and you just felt warm and fuzzy. I think the holidays are the most wonderful time of the year. I really really do. It's the most joyous, it's the most colorful, and the music is, is divine. Happy holidays.